Hi guys, welcome to Empower and my name is Carolyn Porter Thomas. Thank you so much as usual for watching my YouTube channel. So in this video I wanted to do a product review for a product called Gloves in a Bottle. As a nurse, we're constantly washing our hands, we're using soap and water, which is my preference. We're also using alcohol sanitizers and I have no idea how many times a day we wash our hands, but it's got to be an incredibly high number. And you know, with all this washing our hands, there's a lot of drying out. These soaps are very harsh. They're meant to basically kill extremely bad bacteria. In the process of killing bad bacteria, they're also potentially killing our good flora, our good bacteria that's on our skin. There's also been a lot of discussion as to say whether or not the hand sanitizers with, with the alcohol base are 100% safe. That has actually been a big concern of mine. That's why I do prefer soap and water as my hand washing preference because I just don't know how much of that alcohol is actually seeping into my skin because we know for the most part a lot of things that go into your skin can also get into your body. So that's always been a big concern of mine, but there hasn't really been anything that I could do about it. So if there's not anything I can do about it, then it's just, I try to, you know, not think about it if I've done everything that I possibly can at the time. So this company called Loves in a Bottle came to me though, and they wanted me to review their product. And they said that what it does is it creates an invisible shield on your hand. It's basically like an emollient. I'm not sure if I'm saying that right, but it basically um, binds to your dead skin cells on the top of the skin. It falls off naturally with the natural slothing of your skin when you get new skin and it will protect the skin from anything getting into it. So I was definitely interested. So my first question was, does this protect from alcohol seeping into the skin? And they said, yes, it does. So I was like, I'm in, let me try it. I tried it out without reading the instructions. And so I put it on and then about a minute later, I had to do something with the patient and I washed my hands. Well, I felt it coming up. So I was like, oh, maybe this isn't really gonna work because I, I literally felt it all coming off. But then I was like, okay, maybe I didn't give it long enough to dry. And so I washed my hands again and I put it on. And then this time I intentionally wanted to give it like two minutes to dry, but I think I ended up giving it like five minutes because I started documenting something and lost track of time. So then the next time I washed my hands, I forgot about it. Like I completely forgot about it. I washed my hands, I dried my hands, and I didn't feel like I needed lotion afterwards. And then I didn't feel like I needed lotion all day, which if you guys are working every day as a nurse, you know that's like impossible to not feel like you need lotion all day. And like literally I just forgot about it. I kept washing my hands, drying my hands, and I 100% forgot about it. I forgot that I even tried this little product, this little bottle that they gave me, I completely forgot. Then when I went home, this was like the defining moment where I knew something was happening because when I got home, I was doing dishes and when I washed dishes, I put the water very hot and I used soap obviously to wash the dishes. And whenever I finish drying my hands, I always feel like cracking always like it's just it's something that I've grown accustomed to and then I just grab lotion and then it's fine but this time I dried my hands and I was intentionally waiting for that cracking moment and it never came that's when I finally remembered oh my gosh I tried this product that's earlier this morning at like 7 a.m. and I was like wow what's in this stuff this stuff really works so you know I went from being like blah about the product to like oh my gosh this is amazing so then I started reading about it and it says it protects against dry irritated skin eczema and psoriasis, cracked feet, it's diabetic friendly, it protects from hand sanitizers and surgical scrubs, frequent hand washing, and home and place irritants. It essentially will not come off, it comes off naturally with exfoliated skin cells. It helps retain your own natural moisture. So then I actually read the instructions on how you're supposed to use it for optimal use because I guess that's probably what everybody else would have done except me. So what you're supposed to do is you are supposed to wash your hands. Uh, now I'm doing it before I leave so I don't have to use the um, antibacterial creams that we have to use. So I, from my house, like actually usually when I'm waiting for the elevator, I'm putting it on my hands and then as I'm driving to work, it's drying. And then by the time I get to work, it's fine. So what you're supposed to do is reapply every four hours. I really, I'm not like very religious about that. I might do it like twice a day max, but even just once a day has been like amazing. But if you want optimal, like if you have problems with your hands, then you might want to just go ahead and do it as they say and, and do it every four hours. 
So before I recorded the video, I wanted to get a little bit of backstory. You know, what is this? How did it come about? And essentially the founder of the product was working in some kind of construction. I don't know exactly, but he was working in some kind of construction with very harsh chemicals. And before they put on their regular gloves, they had to put on a cream similar to this, and then they were able to put the gloves on. And what that was for was the chemicals that they were working with were so harsh that if they got in their skin, they could seriously harm them. But this cream was created a barrier that way if their gloves ripped, they would be okay if the chemicals got in their skin because this cream was protecting their skin. And so he was working in this like one area of what he worked with and so he thought, well, what about all the other construction workers or other people that do things with their hands? They might want it too. He came with a product and he started selling it in hardware stores because that's where he thought his target market was. So I guess a few years later, a few dermatologists started recommending it to their patients and they started seeing incredible results. I'll put some pictures up here so that you can see them. But these are mainly results from dermatologists that you're seeing. And so then they started selling it in drugstores and on Amazon. So they told me that you can find it in drugstores. I haven't particularly looked, but I do know that you can find it on Amazon. Now I'm not exactly sure who told them that healthcare workers would want to use it, but I'm really glad that they did because that's what led them to me and that's what helped me try the product and now I get to share it with you. Now guys, this, this product is not really expensive. This bottle in and of itself it has 100 ml in it. It says it has approximately 150 applications. So for the price, I can't remember how much it is, but I will put some links below to where you can find the product obviously. And they did say that they would give away a few bottles to my subscribers. So if you're not already subscribed, make sure you are subscribed. And also give the video a thumbs up if you want more giveaways. You guys, literally don't wait to get this product. You'll feel so much better. You're gonna protect your skin. It's gonna feel so much better. And I hope you like it as much as I did. Come to think of it guys, this would be like an amazing Christmas present too for a nurse. So if you're looking for a good gift idea for a nurse, then maybe you should pick this up because it would be nice. All right guys, I really hope that you like this product review. I know I've been a little bit slow on my channel, but don't worry, 2017, you're going to see a lot of new videos. I am going to take some more time off for the holidays to spend some time with my family. And I hope you enjoy the time with your family as well. But um, anyways, I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching and see below for the giveaway details. And until then, I will talk to you soon. Love you. Bye. Let's stay connected, guys. No matter where you are in the world, join me here every Monday at 6.30 a.m. Eastern Time for the weekly nursing pre-huddle before your regular huddle. This will help you start your week off on the right note. Also, get email notifications as soon as the videos are published. By joining my email list, you will receive 25% discount on my best-selling books. The first book, How to Succeed in Nursing School, has been called the best nursing school preparation guide for thousands of students just like you. Many say it's a must-read before entering nursing school school. In this book, I share how I went from a very average student to graduating nursing school with honors. It also includes tips on how to choose your nursing school, how to be successful in nursing school, and how to stay motivated and driven while in nursing school. The second book, New Nurse, How to Get, Keep, and Love Your Nursing Job, is an outstanding book to help nurses start their careers on the right foot or rekindle their love for nursing. We all join this profession for altruistic reasons, but sometimes the stress of the job has us beaten down. This book, I promise, will help you reignite your love for the amazing work you do. And finally, by joining, you will also have access to a 40% discount for my How to Study for Anatomy and Physiology program. In this program, I share how I went from a C average student to two semesters later was on the Dean's List. I've shared these tips with thousands of other students and they have phenomenal results. Click here for information on how to join my email list. And oh yeah, make sure you subscribe to the channel also. I'll see you guys next week. Love you. Bye.